Welcome back. We had our week off, and now we're back and, and ready. Now, now we're back. Now Danny has paws and ears, even though she has ears almost all the damn time. These ears are nothing new. That's true. Those, those ears have been seen plenty of times. Um, but hell yeah. Happy Saturday. Happy Saturday, everybody. Hope that um, every your weekend's going well. We went shopping. We did. We uh, we went out this morning. Um, hey, hey, hey! What's up, Laz? What's up, Marilyn? Hi. We went and got some cool stuff from this place called Neko Mart this morning. Mm -hmm. Got a nice little uh, soy milk um, boba black tea drink. I'm going to drink on the stream tonight. Had another one that was a brown sugar one. That was very good. That was good. Yeah. And but. then we went and had some... some uh, some poke bowls. Yeah, some poke. It was a very eventful morning. It was. Thank you, Natalie and Jimmy, yes, thank for uh, inviting us. All right, this might explode a verse. Let me do this. Oh no, it's fine. Yep. Yeah, Marilyn. Yep. I love cattle decapitation. They're um, one of the one of the first really heavy early bands that I got into. I would say. Don't try and drink that with it. Oh, I'll, I'll drop no. it. Yeah, you will. <laughs> so we're watching Piranha. We are watching Piranha, yes. Um, Piranha won the poll. Yep. Little baby Baphomet, yep. Oh, he's... Oh, it's not Baphomet, actually. No. He's it's a bat. A, just a bat. He's my little... He's my little satanic bat. My little satanic bat. Um, so we are watching Piranha. Piranha is available on Shudder. It is also available on Canopy. Uh, I've talked about Canopy before. It is a free streaming service. You can sign up through... All you need is a library card. Um, and you've got a free streaming service. It's really awesome. And we're, uh, we're not sponsored. Not sponsored, <laughs> no. But I just love them. I've watched so many movies on there. They have a lot of, lots of classic films. Lots of uh, world cinema, art films. Um, very, very awesome streaming service. If you have a uh, library card. And if you don't have a library card, just go get one. There's tons of tons of movies what on you, there. What if you have overdue books? What do you do? Then you have to pay your fucking thing. <laughs> <laughs> I had overdue books and I had to pay. Yeah. Um, uh, but luckily, I'm good. That was from years ago that I've, I had overdue books. Um, but yeah, that or Shudder. I know most of you guys have Shudder. Um, currently, tonight, we're going to be watching it from my 20th anniversary DVD that I bought well, a long time ago. Very proud. Very proud. Thank you, Marilyn. And hello, Snow Guys. Hello, Snail Guts. But yeah, Piranha is very fun. Um, we we're watching the original. We're not watching the uh, remake, but the remake is also fun in a different it's way. Is it old? It's 78, 1978. That's not too bad, though. Yeah. Um, having fun isn't hard when you have a library card. That's right, Ben. <laughs> ben only comes in here for Arthur references. <laughs> is, that a, is that an Arthur reference? Yes. Every, oh, my God! I didn't, I didn't even know! Every reference he, he's made, like, the... Jekyll, Jekyll, Hyde, Jekyll, Hyde, Hyde, uh, Jekyll. That's ben, is that also, what you're doing? Is that is that your jape? That's also... You're just coming in and doing Arthur stuff? Well, it's not a jape if I know what he's doing. <laughs> Aww. Ben, see, you're missed. By them. Hello, Cascus. <laughs> just kidding, I'm sorry. I couldn't resist. You be nice to Ben. <laughs> ben hardly says anything anymore, so... It, it, it's it's his uh it's his Kaufman bit his Andy Kaufman bit he's gonna come in with Babar wait Babar Babar did I say Babar what were we talking about Arthur they both end with an R okay they both end oh, with an R oh wow yeah well they are both about talking anthropomorphic animals so I'll give you that as well hello Cascus hi Cascus thank you guys for joining us um. <laughs> Oh, I also just want to uh, say I do have the giveaway going on right now for the uh, for the blue copy of Ruin Nostalgia. If you go to my Instagram, uh, you can the post. I think it's like the first one of the first three posts of the last three posts. All you have to do is uh, share the post, comment on the po share the post, tag me in your story share, and then comment on the post itself. Um, that's that's running until the end of the weekend. I'll announce the uh, winner on Monday. Wait, did you show them the tape? Yeah. Okay. Here, let you do it. Do a Vanna White. No. No, Danny doesn't want to do a Vanna White. 
<laughs> just there. There you go. I do it the way I do it. Yeah. Oh hey. Ben is Peyton. Also, I'm I just want to share, but don't pick me. Okay. I want someone else to win. That's so nice, Liz. <laughs> um. So, I just want to show a couple more. So I do have a white variant also that I did. Um. I guess I don't know. Um, you don't know what to do. With I don't it. know. I, I just like making them. I think I might just put some of the color variants up in the store if anybody cares. Or maybe you know what would be fun just just to randomly send them. One of the next few orders just randomly gets the color tape. I don't know. We'll see. I'm still figuring it out. I'm j I'm doing the giveaway first. I'm starting off with the giveaway, and then we'll see. Hell yes, Marilyn. I do it my way. Dan is sweet sight. Sweet. 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 <laughs> That's like you're trying to pronounce uh, fucking Italian today. And I did, so, to... okay, so uh, we're going to go see Blood and Black Lace, the Mario Bava film, uh, in a few weeks at the Cinematary at the Majestic, and um, I tried to pronounce the Italian title. Didn't go so well earlier today. It usually doesn't. No, not at all. It's not known for... They Go both around. end in R. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I mean, when he puts it like that, it does sound ridiculous. I mean, I sound ridiculous most of the time, That's so. That's true. That's true. Um, oh, shout out. Let's, since Laz is here, let's shout out Laz's podcast, uh, Shot on Audio. It, I've been on, uh, there's two episodes, and I'm on both of them. <laughs> I did the first one, and then I had to come back for Malignant. Uh, the first one we did on the latest Jurassic World uh, movie. Um, but I believe that's available on YouTube and pretty much anywhere you get your podcasts. So please go check it out. I think we had uh, two really cool discussions for both episodes. So we... Oh! Ah ha ha! Only oh. the best podcast ever fucking made. Luke! Or, I'm sorry, Laz. Why don't you say that when you post about it? You post about it and you go... Maybe it's listen a, to this? He's like, listen to it if you really sure? want. Sure? I don't care. <laughs> hey, I don't think we can dog anyone for being bad at self-promotion when we're really bad I at I know, it too. I know, I know. We're not good at selling ourselves at yeah, all. Yeah, it's hard. It's hard. It's hard when you don't want to feel skeevy, you know what I mean? We also had a, a good time last night hanging out with some friends of yes, ours. Yes, we did. And we took some, some awesome pictures. Yes, yes. Uh, and some of those, uh, a lot of those pictures are both on me and Will's Instagram yeah. currently, if, so if you want to check them out, go ahead. If you follow us on Instagram, please throw us a like. I don't know what's going on with <laughs> oh, Instagram. Like a, like, a, oh, like a scavenger hunt. That would be cool. But then what if, like, nobody goes and finds it? It's just, I would be like, what the... <laughs> It'll be like, I wasted a color Wasted variant. a colored fucking shell, which I have been scouring the earth for. You've been scouring thrift stores. The earth, okay? <laughs> it's the earth. Um, oh, well, that's an interesting idea. I, yeah, just throw it in there. Yeah. Then people are like, this doesn't have a with, price. With no it. case. Yeah, 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 no yeah. No case. Don't waste a case on that shit. Well, I wouldn't want to waste a colored shell. Maybe I'll no, just do it No, I'm not a... saying don't do a colored shell. Yeah. I mean, make a regular one yeah. and leave it in, in a good one. Okay. Yeah, we'll see. Okay. A lot of stuff, our, our friend... Someone thinks it's... Yeah, right? Our friend, uh, Megan, she's, uh, she does art. Her name is Dirty Teacups Designs on Instagram. She has, she, people have, I think, donated her stuff to Goodwill, and then it, other people have bought it, and it, like, blew up her and whole then, thing. Yeah, and like, she got a her. bunch of orders and stuff. Yeah. It's great. Hey, Nancy. Nancy, hello. I don't think Luke has been in yet, but we got... The Luke bag, the sequel. Oh my god, you wrote that on there? Because, yes. <laughs> because Luke, yes. Luke sent uh, uh, me a bunch of crab chips for my birthday. We need to uh, we need to put more chips in there. Probably. Yeah, we're going to continue. This is just the chips of the bags that popped. Yeah, there's only, only two uh, only two of them popped this time, so that's good. Weed, oh no. Who mentioned weed? What weed? <laughs> <laughs> this is these are crab chips. This is this is this not, is, yeah, this this is, are, not weed. Chips, this is not weed. <laughs> we wouldn't show uh, we wouldn't show our weed. Oh, <laughs> happy early birthday, yeah. Nancy. We do so. I smoke crab chips. Hell yeah, why not? Smoke the crab. I chips. smoke a the crab. Because smoke crab chips. Hold on. 
fucking everything. Ah, I smoke everything. There. Not everything, but you know. Streamlabs is You being dare me and stupid. I'll smoke it. I'm just kidding. Is you it? dare me and I'll smoke it. Here's some fucking angel dust. Smoke <laughs> it, I dare you. Alright. <laughs> See you tomorrow. Go into the moon Uh Streamlab what's Streamlabs doing? I want it the stuff's not coming up. There's some kid on Smoke's YouTube. Smoke's a Twix sm bar? Well, yeah, I mean. Jesus Christ. Come on. I've seen somebody smoke really fucking Cloud up bot. Don't smoke hair. That's a bad idea. Don't smoke don't smoke cinnamon. Well no. Don't smoke uh Don't breathe it in either. Whatever they say in idle hands, don't smoke that shit. What you know what? Rule nutmeg, thumb. don't smoke nutmeg. Real rule of thumb. Whatever they do in idle hands, don't do yeah, that. Yeah, don't do that. I think that's just a good rule. Really, you shouldn't smoke anything. Yeah. I mean, not, combustion in your lungs is not good. Yeah, well. Um, yeah, I know. Oregano! Thank you, Cascus. <laughs> Grippos. They come in a box with legit plus. <laughs> what, is, what are Grippos? Yeah, we don't know what Grippos I don't know are. what a grip. I've never heard of a Grippo. Are those shoes? It's a hippo that likes to fucking grab you. Grippo. Wow, how imaginative. It's very imaginative. It's not. Yes, it is. Old Grippo. <laughs> is that what you want people to call you when you're old? No, I'm not a gripper. Yeah, moving on. <laughs> oh, they're just tater chips. Oh, uh, okay, okay. This, it's hard to get the uh, the boba out well, of this. Well, boba's not meant for a can. Boba's not meant for a can. It's good, but I can't get the boba out. Handsy, handsy hippos. You, that's our entire relationship. It See, is. making jokes. The, but I do say really stupid shit, and sometimes, like, I won't hear anything, and then, like, two seconds go by, and then Danny's just like, <laughs> like she, she she like it takes a second and like I know she wants to hate that I said it I know yeah. she's like that's stupid, stupid. but the laugh the... still eventually comes I don't wanna and give it makes the... me happy she doesn't want to give me the satisfaction nope. but she knows I'm funny she knows it <laughs> she wouldn't be with me if I if I wasn't funny yes I'm with you for your sense of humor no I have no, no. so I think here's the thing I think if you are a male and you're funny doesn't matter what you look like, you, women, you'll, a woman, a woman, a woman, a woman will be attracted to you. No. I think so. No. No? Okay. Do you want me to point out, uh, an example we've seen for, with our own eyes? No. But. I mean, we, I won't, I don't know his, I mean, I know his name, but I don't know his name. You know who I'm talking about. The stand-up comedian at the event. Oh, yeah, but he's not that funny. He's pretty funny, uh, and he's also got an accent, and girls love that. Not New York accent. <laughs> I don't think many women are like, oh, that New York accent. <laughs> you never yeah, know. Yeah, yeah. You never know. That's like somebody... Look, there are people into Ted Bundy. I don't, I don't even, like, I don't even know anymore. You know what I mean? Yeah. I don't understand how you get everyone to that point. Is, everyone is someone's uh, fetish. I thought you were with him because he's an internet heartthrob. It's exactly why she's with me. She's like, oh, people on the internet you say... You and Charm do a lot, though. You have yeah! To, you have to be hot and funny, Marilyn! And good at <laughs> some sort of affection. <laughs> See, Marilyn and I got it. It's true. Wait, the balls are in the can? It wasn't, like, at... No, yeah, no, no, they're in here. The boba... They're not even balls. They're, like, little cubes. Girls like my shitty accent, and I don't know <laughs> either. I hate accent. Laz, I, I love your accent as well. Mm. I've, even, I've told Will as Not much. a bunch. I'm with Will for many reasons. Will also has an accent. I, had to, I, was, I do. I pointed that out to him pretty early on in our relationship. And he's I was like, like, I fucking know. He's like, I know. He's like, I know. And then like you said, like, Bam Margera. And he's like, great. Yeah. Say hoagie. I'm not saying hoagie. <laughs> oh, <God laughs> damn. Oh. I put a lot on that. That didn't just come out. That was me that's putting my no, accent on. No, that's bullshit. It. When you're when you speak normally, you're not thinking about. When it. I'm not thinking, yeah, I literally have to think ass. Is it the eh? ass? No, no your ass. O's are what give it away. It's my O's. Yeah. <laughs> I'm from Baltimore. The fucking O's, man. Baltimore. 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 <laughs> 
Oh, hey, thanks, Streamlabs. What's Finally that? doing your fucking job. <laughs> <laughs> you got a taste of Will as a manager for a minute. Uh, no, I was a good manager. I was nice to everybody. I, know you were. I never, I never was like that with anybody you, when I was a manager. Wait, so you never lost your shit with anyone as a manager? No, I felt bad when I had to fire somebody because they weren't really doing their job. But you never, like fucking yelled at anyone? No, okay, okay, so there was <laughs> there was one time, I was, there was this place I was working at, and this, uh, a new person came in, and I felt like they were doing everything to try and take my job. Okay. Like, I felt like they were coming in, and, like, they were fucking with shit that I would do, mm -hmm. and then I'd come in later, and it was different, and I would, <laughs> that is when I was like, no, like, like, look, <laughs> I have this for a reason, I'm the store manager, I put this here like this for a reason, do not fuck with it. Yeah, she quit. <laughs> What'd you say to her? <laughs> Nothing. What'd I was you just, do? I was being very stern and like, dude, like, no. Like, like the, and she quit the next day. Yeah. Jesus, Will. Not the next day. No, no. It was okay. like a few weeks later. Throwing watermelons. What's what's uh? What's Evil Russian? fruit manager. <laughs> Wait, are you talking about when you worked at Edible Arena? Yeah, yeah, yeah. What did you do? What? What do you mean? What is he talking about? Throwing watermelons? I didn't throw water. We'll <laughs> confirm <laughs> Will is an awful person. Just don't undermine me. I don't like that shit. I don't like that at all. <laughs> I just love it. Like, she quit. <laughs> 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 it's just so funny. <laughs> Like, it didn't help your case at all. You were like, yeah, she quit. <laughs> yeah, look, I, don't fuck with my shit. I did it for you. you yeah. <laughs> Sorry. Will made a girl cry and quit. I did not make her cry. She was. You she don't was, know. She might have went home no, and cried. No, she's not. She was not a crier. <laughs> she, I don't know. Would you say I'm a crier? Yes. I am. But would you know that from the outside? No. Exactly. You never know. You never know. Is a big fucking crybaby. That's and true. That's what I am. That's and true. And I think people would. Either people. It would, was like whiplash with fruit. People would either believe that like wholeheartedly about me right away, or. They wouldn't, because they don't know me very well. Yeah. <laughs> Just standing over somebody cutting fruit. Evil. Do it again. Evil, Slap evil, them with. Evil <laughs> fruit manager. No, that's not the right cut. Do that shit again. No, I really like. <laughs> <laughs> it's got very real. I don't even know how we got to this. I was talking about you being a manager yelling at people. I didn't yell. I, that was the I one person that I was... That what, was the one person. Do you know person. what you specifically said to her, though? I, like, arranged the fridge a certain way. Like, because you went... In edible arrangements, you come in, they got a fridge, and you have things there to buy. I arranged it a certain way. I put some stuff up in the store. Like, you know, like, promotional stuff and things like that. And then I came in the next day, and she changed it. And I was just like, no! Like, <laughs> not, no! <laughs> this is not how it goes. Is that what you said? Something like that. I got pissed off. I definitely felt that she was gunning for my job. I don't know why. Maybe I'm wrong. My shit getting here. <laughs> <laughs> I could have been wrong. Maybe it's just my. Maybe I just had some weird insecurity. I thought she was trying to take my job, but that's how I felt. And I don't. I've never felt that way any other time ever. So I would like. I would like to think that that was just me being right. And <laughs> not being paranoid. No, like yeah, because I've never ever felt that way ever. For, for any other job. What if she was like, she went home and she cried to her family and was like, I tried really hard, I tried my hardest, oh. and I got yelled at, and I'm gonna quit. Cause well, this is years ago, she's fucking over it now. <laughs> if she's not over it by now, that poor girl lays <laughs> <laughs> She didn't give a fuck, man. Yeah, Marilyn, I, yeah, I'm a crier. I, <laughs> hey, Bill. I do get yelly. But not in jobs. If I get frustrated in a job or I get scared in a job, I'll just cry. I won't actually, like, lose my shit like I do other times. Mm. I will just cry. Like, you know, when I got fired from the liquor store, I remember I called you on the way home and I was crying. Yeah. Like, I'm walking down the street in Baltimore. People are passing me and I'm just crying on the phone with you going, I got fired! <laughs> oh my god. That reminds me of my breakup story. Did I say that on stream before? Which one? The one where you yelled the c word? No. Oh. <laughs> no, that wasn't even a breakup, unfortunately. That uh, the yeah, one where my girlfriend broke up with me when I was eighteen, and I had some stuff at her house, including a big, giant, fluffy purple pillow. Oh my God. 
this, and yeah, this story. <laughs> <laughs> I am like walking down the street, fucking just just sad and just just fucking head down, and I have this giant fluffy purple pillow under my arm. <laughs> Just, I'm so much like a picture Just of walking home. And my friend who worked at a restaurant on the street, that street at the time, he apparently, like, messaged my other friend and was like, I just saw Will, like, really sad walking down the street. Like, what's, do you know what's up? He didn't mention the pillow? No. <laughs> <laughs> I'm grateful he didn't mention He had a big-ass fluffy pillow. What the fuck's up with that? fluffy pillow. What the hell's going on? Yeah. <laughs> like dragging a little red balloon, but yeah, pretty much, pretty much. Sorry, I think I just screamed into the microphone. Man, uh, how sad would that have been if at the same time you got mugged? That would have sucked. <laughs> that would have sucked. I did get mugged when I when I when I was taking a walk because I was upset. That was at the same girl. That was with the same girlfriend before. <laughs> but yeah, I got. Wow. I, yeah, yeah. Jeez, that's a lot of trouble. Yeah, for you. yeah, right. Fucking got mugged. Put a gun in my stomach. Yeah, you hear that? Stole my MP3 player. You hear that, Candace, if you're watching? That's just wrong. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> well, fuck you too, Candace. Danny doesn't, re- doesn't, Danny doesn't remember any of my ex's names. Not that you need to, but you get them confused. Actually, you get them confused all the time. No, no, no. I do remember their names. I just, I get You don't them remember the time because, period. Yeah. Absolutely not. All right. No. Enough about this shit. <laughs> you hear that, Sasha, you bitch? Yeah. <laughs> you broke my heart. Sasha. <laughs> Sasha. No, but Will did date, I won't, and I won't say her name, but Will, Yeah, don't be saying any names. I'm not, Jesus. but I'm just gonna say, you, we all, I feel like we all dated somebody with a name that we now look back on and go, that's a stupid name. Oh, I thought we were just making up names. No. <laughs> Candace is an ex of mine. That's a real name. Just not, not, not the right one. Who gives a shit? I would love for something to come up and be like, hey, what the fuck? Yeah. And I'd be like... That's my best friend. I can't believe that shit. <laughs> <laughs> it's like, whoa, you got that with just the no, first name? No, I mean her herself. I'd be like, okay, Anne. Oh, God. Like, I'd be like, yeah, dude. <laughs> they they say what? Along with the girl he yelled at. Yes. I'd be like, yeah. <laughs> I'd, be like, yeah all... what's, I'd be like, yeah, what's up? Oh, my God. I'm not afraid of no one. I know Sasha's a real name, but I never knew a Sasha. <laughs> I, oh, I, look at that. What happened? Look at you, Ben. It's like you're trying to take sneak a drink. Ugh. I took a picture so it doesn't fuck up. Hey, Miss Cogsmith. Candace exposed. <laughs> I don't give a fuck. I really don't. All right, shall we go into Piranha? Sure. So stop talking about we <laughs> all of all of the horrible things I'll name in, all my, my in my past. Oh, right I don't now. Give a shit. Go. Bam, 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 bam. Do you want bam. me to? Right. Friggin' Steven, Jacob. Shout out, Matt. Um, <laughs> if you, I mean, if I you're mean, in the Discord, you might know who, might know yeah, who Matt shout is. Shout out to Matt the werewolf. Um, uh, the bill's like, no X talk. How is everybody? Spencer. Uh, Donnie. <laughs> Dan- Danny went out with Donnie Wahlberg. No, she I doesn't didn't. like to talk about it that much. But, like, right after New Kids on the Block, they hooked up. Oh, my God. Remember While my, he was filming Saw I two. remember my sister telling me when I was dating Donnie, she was just like, you can't marry him. And I went, I don't, wasn't going to. And she went, good. She, she said, told you. Because then she was like, because then it'd be Danny and Donnie. Danny and Donnie. She was Donnie. like, you can't do that. Danny and Donnie Marie. Yeah, shout out to, uh, yeah. You know why you couldn't shout date out. Donnie? You know why you couldn't date Donnie? Because he wasn't the right stuff. Oh, God. <laughs> oh that hurt. That hurt. Fuck I know, it. I know the middle. The I know the first, middle, and last name of every person I did, but Lord knows I would really <laughs> have to. Think, oh, that's the same thing with me. Well, I am leaving. <laughs> <laughs> well, I, stop! I turn 34 and there, all these horrible jokes come out. That's how it is. Matt got the full moon. That's right, Luke. Boo! <laughs> <gasps> wow, you got no love for that shit. Bring the hate. I've been through the Freddy Got Fingered stream. I'm fucking clean now. Oh, it's true. He can endure anything. <laughs> I can now. endure anything. Anything. Oh, Oh, I mean, I I know the like the first and last name middle names. Fuck me, I don't think I could remember, but I can remember the first and last names, definitely of all the people who have wronged me. <laughs> <laughs> I 
I know where they live. I know their <laughs> birth date. I know their social security number. God damn. All right, I promise no more bad jokes. He, no. That's a lie. Don't you fucking listen to a word I'll he's try, saying. I'll try to make them good. I like saying bad jokes when I know they're bad jokes. I just love everybody who was like, stop it. Yeah. It was really bad. I was like, Will, we're going to hate you if you don't shut the fuck up. Okay, everybody get prone already. I was just going to say, all the all me naming them was just take the heat off you. I don't give a, I don't give a Thank shit. Thank you. People coming out the woodwork. Yeah, Matt was a werewolf, by the way. Or at least he thought he was. Oh, God, you're going to say this on stream. I don't care. I really don't care. Uh, again, again, if if this person ever shows up and then says anything, what are they gonna say? No, I didn't. Yeah, no, no I'm, I didn't. I'm still a werewolf. Why that. would I make that shit up? That's more embarrassing to me than anything else. Yeah, true. Oh, we all dated morons. I mean, come on. Not a real wolf. Just a pretend just werewolf. A pre yeah, just a pretend wolf. Not a real <laughs> werewolf. Fucking poser. <laughs> all right. All right, let's start let's this. Let's start the movie. Before we keep talking. Yeah, where we dig our grave even more. I don't care. <laughs> Alright, everybody, let's do the countdown. <laughs> you ready? Yeah. Okay. Five, four, three, two, one, play. Right. I never signed a non disclosure Yeah, exactly, that's right. I can go off about whoever the hell I feel like. <laughs> <laughs> Excuse me. Oh, shit, shit. Those I are werewolves and Mars. Oh, look what you did. Sorry. You fucked it up. It's a little, it's a little off. I would actually love to know how much people actually use that, you know, to help them. Look, I would watch the fuck out of that. Got these. So I Those are werewolves of Mars. So I thought that's a, it says God, these titles, God, well, I'm sure it meant God, these titles are 70s. Um, I thought that said titties. I thought I read titties too, right, cool. and I was like, Laz said it. He probably said titties. I definitely read it as titties. <laughs> definitely titties. Definitely titties. Oh shit, we need some subbies, huh? Uh, uh. Excuse me. Yeah, let's go. Uh, let's go hiking uh, in the nighttime. Wow, I see how it is. <laughs> God, these titties are seventies. The I'm titties are so seventies. They're good 70s titties, though. There's lots of good Maryland. 70s titties. There might be 70s butt. You yeah. never know. There's lots of 70s butt. Is there? Yeah. This... What were, What did we watch recently that had a bunch of butt in it? Um, oh, Adrift. Oh, Adrift does a A very lot bad of movie called Brazilian Adrift. Brazilian butt. Brazilian butt, man, woman, all kinds of butts. <laughs> I bet people thought you were going somewhere else. All of the butts. It's good. Oh, there's no subtitle track? Boo on this DVD. I'm sure we're really missing out on the eloquence that is Piranha. I just think of old people when I hear 70s titties. There's whole three whole titties that are good in the 70s. Nah, uh That's a good point. I have plenty of films that say different. I will. I will compose a werewolves from Mars in my house while I'm not a racist. <laughs> That's one and a half sets. I don't welcome composers of any kind of mind. What if, like, one boob is good and the other one isn't? Unless you make a living as, as like, an impersonator. Other than that. Goddamn boba. There we go. Yeah, let's go swimming in the reservoir. Ew, why? What the hell's the matter with you? I don't know. People back... Whoa! It was great. Oh, no. People back then did some shit. No one wants to hear about your vintage porno collection. Danny ignoring the one tick question, yeah. Wait, did you? Ask I do not have a vintage porno collection. It's just Euro trash. That's all. What? 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 Danny's the one with the vintage porn collection. Let's get wet. Am I? Yeah, you are. Last one is what? Where? You hit. You hide it from me. No. Yeah. You were the one who wanted to buy the. Wait a minute. The really weird what? one. Well, yeah, because it's weird, and I want to hear the commentary on it. <laughs> You're gonna get your boyfriend eaten by piranhas. Oh my phone! I'm just kidding. Will only watches 4K. That's right. No, I, no, no, no. Actually, I watch vintage, vintage that is has been restored in 4K. 
Why would you switch? Thanks to vinegar syndrome. This girl's 35 and has pigtails. Yeah, that was Corman. Corman was like, hey, you gotta look younger. Well, her underwear came down there for a second. She had to pull back up. Yeah. Because she was like, I will show my boobs. I'm not showing anything else. Wow. Holy shit. AI upscale porn. Let's Ew. not go to that place in Montana. Military test site no trust. Oh my god. <laughs> They're dumb. They deserve to die. Don't be ages. Oh, Damn. Well, oh, hey. Um, sorry, it just came up in the chat, so I thought about it. Um, the Why Would You Show Me the Shirts, uh, they're $10 off now. Uh, we have small and medium left if anybody wants to get one. They're gonna stay fifteen bucks until they're sold out. So it's okay, Marilyn. My uh, my sister is over uh, over the age of thirty five and also wears pigtails. Yeah. Here, so. Uh, I yes, I actually have corruption. Um, I like corruption a lot. It's it's. I like it too. Right. No. Nope. Do you remember corruption? It's basically like the dude going through porn hell. No, I hate it. Danny didn't like that one. No, cause I hate the guy in it. Yeah. Not Harry Reams. What what what's his name? It's the other guy, the other famous one. Harry Reams was in the the Andy <laughs> Milligan movie, uh, Flesh Pot on thirty four, thirty sixth or whatever, forty eighth. Luke's gonna get his ass beat. Don't back to ah oh, Luke. Marilyn's gonna fucking bust out the knives. Where She's gonna get Mike Patton to kick your ass. Yeah. Oh, it's down there somewhere. I can't grab it. No, I like that dude's movies. Uh, the guy, the director of Corruption. Can't remember his name right now. But he also made uh, Last House on Dead End Street. Interesting uh, horror film. I can't. I mean, I don't. You know, I don't hold anyone against. I don't hold it against anyone for liking Corruption or anything. It's just that guy. I can't look at him for more than five minutes. I know. I don't know why. Roger Wet Watkins, thank you, yes. Dick Miller! Fuck yeah, I mean, Dick Miller. and I also just say this, but a lot of 70s porn is fucking disgusting. It just is. <laughs> I mean... There's just something about it that's grimy and disgusting, and I feel skeezy, like, watching it. Yeah. You know what I mean? I don't know. Mike Patton wouldn't hurt a fellow agoraphobe. <laughs> I just, you know, it's they actually cared about the production back then, and now it's nothing, so. That's not true. Nobody's writing a script nowadays. Nobody's like... Yeah, because they widened up and we're like, oh, yeah, this isn't really what people are watching it for. Not here for the story. They're not reading... That's like saying, oh, I get Playboy for the articles. No, you <laughs> fucking don't. Let's stop talking about this, or, Mel or else Maryland's... Oh, a Jaws game. Wow. I love that. I love that they... That's right there. It's like, yeah. Oh, my God, I went outside today for four minutes and almost fucking died. I'm Should be on Enter left, bang it out. Yeah, that's the script nowadays. I appreciate that. I like no. I like when they tried to make it in a film. Okay, we're all set. And when you get the Indian Springs, you'll get a jeep. The road's very And the thing about corruption is that corruption even is like meta because Roger Watkins never wanted to direct porn. It's just all that he could get. So that movie is very much like shitty. No. Whatever. I'm done. I'm done talking about it. Let's watch Piranha. Well, let's not even get into the fact that I believe I have porn right here in front of me. You're a city kid, and these kids are way out. Are you kidding me? No! You're not touching this. I'm holding it up. Fine. Fine. This is right in front of me. Emmanuel. Two Emmanuel films, yes. I could have sworn I put it in my pocket. This is the man I'm with. And it's fine. I like how those two don't even go, this is the man I'm with. And you go, it's fine. It's fine. That's just you trying to tell yourself it's fine. 
Money. No, I just think it's hilarious that you're like, let's start talking me. about this. And then I look down and immediately see Emmanuel. <laughs> and it's just too Emmanuel funny. around the world, the yes. X rated version. You yeah. suck. I like my porno gonzo thing, you know, pretending. <laughs> Laz, you're, you, you know, you're fucking, you, I don't even know. <laughs> oh my god, Marilyn, I love it. Drone shot. Andy. Yes. I want to see a porno yes. that's shot only by drones. Only by a drone. What is this shirt? Let me see this shirt. <laughs> that dog dies in the lead, right? Yeah. Oh, that's pretty sweet. It is pretty cool. Shadows of the Mind was... A lovely but sad film. My copy is so fragile. Shadows of the Mind. I'll have, have to look that up. That. I don't know that one. In space. There's one. No, I'm not. I could talk about this all night, so no, I'm not gonna do that. Dare. I'm not gonna keep going down that road. <laughs> Will doesn't want to be known as a sex yeah. pervert. Who wants? Who wants to? Who wants to join my vintage adult film podcast? <laughs> you know what? Probably quite a few people here. Somebody probably already already does it. Down there, but I ain't gonna walk down there and get it. Man, can I live by booze alone? That looks like the same. Like that looks a lot like the dog my grandpa used to have. Luke, look at it. <laughs> Apparently, they did. I'll watch it. Hey, if it's anything like ambulance, I'll fucking watch it. I feel like we should make a specific channel for that in the Discord now. Really? Porn talk? Yeah, so... <laughs> I can see Marilyn will never... Get, that'll always Marilyn's stay... Like, that not... will always be red on <laughs> Marilyn's Discord. Yeah, Marilyn's... Or unread, I'm sorry. Marilyn, yeah, and Marilyn, uh... Marilyn's like, I don't want to be a mod anymore. Goodbye. Yeah, I'm not moderating that. Oh, fuck, fuck that. fuck that movie. <laughs> That's true. You about seeing a strange just earlier. Marilyn, I'm gonna channel. contact all of your friends, and then I'm gonna make a fucking porno with your friends, what? and then be like, "Here you go, Marilyn. You can finally watch <laughs> something. You can." <laughs> I got scotch. <laughs> that would be the weirdest fucking She's thing ever. She's gonna leave now. She'd that would be, like, be the well, weirdest thing ever. You're gross. I'm gone. <laughs> Come on. Does it start Lindsay Lohan? <laughs> That's a very thoughtful gift idea. <laughs> <laughs> this is supposed to be about deadly fish. <laughs> I don't know. How did we get on this? How did it happen? Oh, I don't know. Oh, man. Yeah. This girl doesn't know how to drive very well. And her outfit's ugly. <laughs> Take off your ugly vest and use that to open the fucking hood, moron. Yeah, I was just... <laughs> <laughs> it's the only thing that fucking ugly-ass vest is good for. Other than sitting by the fire and knitting. The talk is more just... Just, you just, kidding. just a whole fish. Just right in there. Oh, yeah. I'm <laughs> Right on the plate. Alright. Yeah. It's been gutted and shit. And, you know. Yeah. You'd hope. Oh. <laughs> yeah, right? It's all sunny outside. Mm -hmm. Right? A couple Hi. podcasts I'm talking about? Oh. Uh, I work for I'm gonna make a point with all your friends. <laughs> it's it's a hard fucking threat, to be honest. I like that Marilyn said it's a thoughtful gift idea, and you say it's a threat. That's because Marilyn knows you, and knows, and knows you mean well by yeah. saying that. I would make it, I would definitely make a very good yeah, film about... <laughs> undercooked bony fish. Uh, That's me. I thought that was a big bacon. I'm a bony fish. Well, I think you are a bony fish. If you had to be a fish, what fish would you well, be? If they drowned, they'd be swept down at the dam, you see. A uh, koi or a goldfish, I guess. Boy, you're the wrong end of the Or I'd be one of those really scary angler fishes. No, yeah. That lives at the bottom of the sea and just kind of exists until I eat. You Can I be a lamprey? They you don't want to be a lamp. Hey, look, I'd rather be one than have to look at one. <laughs> Lampreys scare the shit out of me, yeah, so I'd rather just be one. Lampreys don't have a tendency to uh, look at themselves in the fucking mirror. No, so. there's no mirrors in the sea, okay? I would so be, you can't fucking. It would be a loving porno, though. I get it now. What a <laughs> Rainbow 
Sumatra are too pretty. Yeah. yeah. I want to be a fish that doesn't get and caught often, kind of, so uh, I'm gonna go with like, <laughs> I'm gonna go with an angler fish. Yeah. A fish that no one cares to Come eat. Come on, let's go. Go where? You're taking me up there. I mean my food. <laughs> Charles Darwin. <laughs> a mud cat? Hell yeah. You think I'm wasting my time here, don't you? No. <laughs> no. <laughs> Yeah, lady, you oh already, you already cracked your fucking uh, 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 okay. windshield. What is with people not respecting what signs say in this fucking movie? I'm pretty sure that's there for a reason. Damn. I like her. She's all... She's like, fuck, we're fucking getting this shit. We're going in yeah, here. Yeah, they should get their windshield fixed or shit. <laughs> Giant fucking crack in it. Cracking... Is he drinking water or booze? I hope it's booze. What? Is, I, think I hope that's a giant thing. Of it whiskey. is because they he did just bring him a bottle of booze, so that is definitely his booze, fucking uh, can. Look, he's got a fucking satchel for it and everything. Just a casual B. Whoa! Is he swigging motor oil? Marilyn, are you watching like a murky VHS? No, I mean that could look like motor oil. I'm sorry, I'm surprised he doesn't have a big old long beard that he keeps it behind. All Thank you for the pants Making him thirsty. You're welcome. I like to do that. Take off that fucking vest. Look at her with a fucking like little hatchet. Yep. She's serious. Dude. David. If I you took me to some place and you just fucking fucked the lock up and went in, I'd be like, I'd be kind of turned on. I'd be like, hell yeah. Well, I, I you know, to be fair, I don't think I would have done that. I would have just hopped the fucking. Thing. Yeah. But that's much cooler, just to like <laughs> angrily fuck up a lock and then open open the I gate. Once, you know, I completely fine. forgot they're looking. Dark so dogs out <laughs> Is it her friend or something? We don't have subtitles and we're talking a lot, so. Oh my god. Well, like I said, I'm pretty sure the dialogue in this isn't super important. It just says Texas. <laughs> I want, I want a belt buckle like that, but I just wanted oh, to say belt the buckle. Said they were yes. Swimmers. Yes. Well, they be Baby, let's break into Walmart. I'm horny as fuck. That's the dangerous kink right there. Wind you up in jail. <laughs> it's true. If I had to save Will's ass doing something... And I, I demonstrated, you know, that kind of shit doing it. And I saved him. He'd be like, hey. Yeah. And I'd be like, Will, we're in a situation. And Will's like, I don't care. Doesn't matter. He's like, I, I still want it. This him. has to happen. And then, and then we can continue. <laughs> yeah, Will would have to get hit by a bus in order for that to not be a thing. My libido knows no bounds. <laughs> by law or any, anything else. Shut up, bunny. We'll get <laughs> Shut uh, bunny. I like shut what the bunny. What the fuck is that thing? That's very true. Yo, what the fuck? Yeah, I said the same thing. <laughs> We're in a situation. <laughs> <laughs> I'd get us killed. Well, we're in a situation. Yeah, we, exactly. We'd get That's exactly killed so quickly, happen. or arrested, or whatever. <laughs> oh well, we definitely get arrested since you've almost been arrested for doing it somewhere. So we're not gonna talk about that. <laughs> we already have. <laughs> no, we haven't. That's been mentioned. We've never talked about that on the stream. I don't think. I'm almost certain we have. Well, that's all. That's all that's happening tonight. Yeah. Ugh. Jesus Christ. It's very frightening. It looks like, is it standing? Yes. Let's get out of here. <laughs> yeah, yeah. That's a good idea. Let's fucking leave. When Will kicked open the gate. <laughs> no, he didn't actually react at all. No, I just did it and then walked through the gate. And I'm the one who laughed. And while Danny was sitting there like, what the fuck? I laughed and almost fell over. Yeah. I was carrying shit, hey, to be fair. <laughs> We both were. That's yeah. why you kicked it open. Yes. We couldn't open it. Well, again, the reason left. I got impressed, by the way, is because the lock on yeah, the gate is, is like shoulder 
uh, height. So it's not like it's down by your waist or anything. <laughs> yeah, that's the thing. Danny had, Danny had to do that. And then it would have been a whole different deal. Well, if it still works, it's pretty yeah. open down there. <laughs> <laughs> Dude, like, it looked like he was just hiding under a, a piece of cloth. Holy shit, I don't remember the stop motion stuff like that. They showed him earlier on, did you not see Yeah, it? no, I remember, I just, like, that was more of it. Of it. Did you ever almost get arrested while doing urban exploration? You guys were pretty good about that. No! Getting caught. Yeah, I, I was never, I ne no cops or anything. Um, we did go into a place where we found a, uh... Do like the 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 call? ground oh, manager's security yeah. office, you and it, he, there was a sign. It was like "Smile, you're on camera." Blah, 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 blah. And um, he was not there. But then we heard later on from other people that they went, and he pulled out a goddamn shotgun on them. So I'm very happy that didn't happen. No, no trouble with the law. What is it? Tastes Water's like salt. fish. Do they even have cops in Baltimore? They do. They do, they're just doing other shit. They're, they're busy uh, fucking up people that don't need to be fucked up. Uh-oh. That's why we had a whole riot in Baltimore in 2015 or 2015. 14. Oh, yeah, no, you're right. Yeah, over uh, Freddie Gray. These people piss me off. Not in one piece. You think he's all right up there? Oh, shit. <laughs> <laughs> this dude's great. The main guy. I love him. He's just fucking drunk. I guess I must have left the keys in it. Huh. Well, that oh, was smart. Yeah, great idea. Oh, you mean you didn't store them in your ugly ass vest? There's no pockets. That's not true. <laughs> I, just, I saw pockets. <laughs> She also got pockets on the stupid blouse she's wearing as well. Oh, sh See? <laughs> oh, my God! God damn! Well, way to go. Well, I think that was a stunt driver, too. Well, let's hope. Holy shit, man. This lady is a stupid bitch! She's going to get a bunch of people killed because she can't go through regular <laughs> Laz, I hope you don't drive then. Laz is out there like it's fucking GTA, just. Uh. Well, you killed. Yeah, this man. How is he alive? It's fun. We have insurance. <laughs> There'll be no way to stop them. You talk sense, but, damn it. Now, what about those kids? I can't tell you. I can't tell you. Oh, mother of God, they'll kill us. They'll kill all of us. Okay, mister. Listen, you're going to sweat it out of you in town. Oh. I don't think he's high. He isn't. No, he might have a fever. That's what he might be. Oh, uh, okay. I thought he meant, like, heroin, like, withdrawals. You're going to sweat it out. Maybe give him some water. Whoa! Whoa! Someone's going to kill you all see that? She just hit me. I out of Time to break into the loot bag. Give me cigarettes. Enjoy that. Thank you. Do you mind if I come in for a minute? Sure. I ordered some chips <laughs> and strawberries. Uh, yes. So did you start? Make sure it's not mutated or, or anything. Your wife. What the hell kind of question is that? Look, I'm sorry. I mean, I was just interested. You might 
<laughs> I've evolved into a ziplock. Yeah. Hey, you're one of the good ones too. You got this thing. How long? You got have? the whole instead of instead of just clip clipping um, it together or whatever. Ten years. Hefty. It was just seventeen when we looked and we caught us. What? You. Yeah. <laughs> and we got right. the world for the balls. Very dangerous to have a gigantic bag of chips. Where'd you live? It is. In town. I'm sure you guys have like how many bags of that shit? A lot. The government closes down, said killing too many fish. This town is gonna end up having a mysterious gas explosion. You know that somebody's making bundles somewhere. How do you make a living now? Back to pay. Yeah. Well, September. I do lumberjack stripper parties. They're really popular. Does your daughter live with you? There's yeah. a few lonely ladies in town that I visit every once in a while. They pay me in a jar of beans <laughs> that I can eat and give some to my dog. You're so tense. Hmm? He's tense? He just put a blanket on himself. <laughs> I used to be in right people. That's obvious. I've been trying to hit my way under the covers for five minutes now. What? She's trying to get with him? Are, they, are we going to cut back to them in bed? Oh! I think they had sex. Nuh-uh. Yeah, huh. She says she's been trying to hint her way under the covers. We have to do something. You might have fractured Oh, thanks, Laz. Thank you for thank you guys for coming, man. You know, we do these mostly because we have fun. It's fun. We like hanging out with you guys, um, so we're just happy that you come and hang out with us. I read my daughter Huckleberry Finn last summer. Meatballs. They pay in meatballs, yeah. The loon call equals sex. The loon call. That's what Will used to call it when, uh, when I called him on the phone. Yeah. Where's your daughter? Uh, the loon's calling. It's the loon call. Let me see what's wrong now. <laughs> Oh, sweet. I always wanted to know what it was like in Huckleberry Finn. Oh, we're finally going to get to the uh, people being murdered by the fish. Fish murder. Hey, where's the lifeguard? Right? Children are by water. Oh, there we go. Yeah, Laz, me too, dude. Everything, like, I don't remember any of this. What I remember most is the people, like, at the beach or in the water, and, you know, I guess that's the end. This might, it might be a big build-up. That's basically what color my hair was when I was younger. Yeah, you had super, super blonde. I had white, I had white blonde. Yeah. And I was probably about that pale. Although, during the summer, I did get really tan because I would spend a lot of time outside. Yeah. Just a, few a big boat. Hmm. I don't know. I don't remember that. Literally, I think I haven't watched the movie since like I bought the DVD and watched it. Oh, this dude. He was in a lot of these old films. Letter for you, Dickinson. Ew! Look at his shoes. Ew! With socks. Ew! God, I want to throw up. And endangering the public? Yeah, that fucking fish fishing vest is pretty ugly. I'm afraid of yucky toes. Yeah, would you rather see that man's feet? That's not... I don't think that's what Cascus means. It's a bit from uh, thing that Kevin... Uh, yes, sir. Right. Is there any mail for King of Queens guy. Kevin James. Kevin James does. It's a bit for okay. again, What's on his fucking belt? Probably a knife or a flashlight. Brogan. Guts. Whoa. Um she's a tiny girl. Yeah. He's like, jump in that fucking water. On, I don't care if you drown. If you drown it means you're not you're not strong enough and you shouldn't be alive. You're a weakling. Yeah. You shouldn't even be here. Yeah. You should be dead. 
If you can't swim, you should just die. You know how I learned to swim? My fucking grandfather threw me into the ocean. I had to make it work. Oh, oh there's Breen. There's Breen. Say hi to Breen. Hey, Say hi to the Breen butt. Dude's living by Spartan oh, rules. Oh, yeah. If you die, you shouldn't even have been alive. Aw. I love the old man. You know he's going to get eaten in a minute. Hell yeah. He's just hanging out with his puppy. Oh, that puppy looks a lot like uh, Cameron's puppy. You see, you've seen him on, uh, on Instagram? Aw. If we have, if we didn't get together, like that would be like a hope for me. Like if I was, if I was just single my whole life, I hope I'd be an old man with an awesome, nice dog hanging out on the lake. That's fucking sad. That guy is piss ass drunk, talking to a dog. Well, dream big. Well, holy shit. This is something I aspire to to be a fucking drunkard. With a dog on the side of a if bank. I, if yeah, look, I, if I, look I'm gonna there's worse stuff. things in life. Okay, my friend. I'm Remember just saying, that? if I was a lonely yeah, old man, it's not a bad life drinking on the lake with a dog. Yeah, I've been number two. Lonely old man. <laughs> what were you doing up at the army site? Stop asking. Oh, he's speaking. Keep your hand out of the water. Will just wants a pup. That's right, I do. I really want uh, a nice animal friend. Danny and I talk about it so much, but we, we just haven't bit the bullet yet. Lieutenant Dan. If you drowns, it means it means you're not a witch. That's right, Luke. Oh, hey, can I try some of your melon bread thing? Oh, shit. Okay. <laughs> your reaction to that was like... I want to try it. Oh, Laz, dude, yeah. We love uh, Danny's parents' dog, Pinky. She's great. So we go and see her, and she kind of gives us a little bit of a, you know, like like we have our own pet a little bit. Oh my God! Is he always so ferocious? The old man is gone. The piranhas ate every single bit of him. Oh, Eric! Hey, happy Saturday, man. Yeah, Pinky's the best. I think just, you know, animals are very so they're soothing. They help they help a lot. I think it's a, it's a good give and take when you have a pet. You take care of them, you feed them and everything and they they take care of you and like you're feeling bad and stuff. Do it. Hell yeah, Miss Cogsmith. I want to see Cookie. Oh, that sucks, Marilyn. You can't have any pet, like, at all? Because Danny have I, have I, and I have talked about getting, like, a guinea pig or, like, a smaller pet as well. Oh, he's not all eaten. I'm sorry. I'll get a shovel. It's a blue healer. Australian cattle dog. Okay. Interesting. No pets! That's bullshit. Oh, man! Yes! He didn't get in an inner cube, huh? No, he didn't. I thought he did, because they showed the dock, and it was just a bunch of blood, and he wasn't there. Just don't get you. Okay, okay, if that's really the way you feel about it, I'll try and help you get out of the race. You've got to come up with an excuse. Do not. Why? I got poison ivy. So does everybody else in the game. Hey, maybe you could just be getting a... Wow, maybe don't minimize her pain. No. Oh. She's nice. They, she, they're trying to come up with a reason no, for No, I her... get that. Okay. 
But at the same time, she said, I got poison ivy in. Yeah, it was an excuse. She doesn't actually have it. I don't think. Hey, kids, let's throw some lawn darts. Okay. Get Darlene to take place in the race, okay? Wow. Dumont Squad. Why is she doing that? Fake injury. And I'll get you a huge bandage for this. Feels like this thing snagged on the bottom. Too. That little girl's like 50 out. now. Oh, you better stay there. Might tip the canoe. Oh, you knew all about Is that good? I wasn't going to help you anyway. Yeah, I'm going to sit here and drink my Coke. Listen, when I was a boy, we made our own nets and made them right. Look at that old 7-Eleven uh, cooler. Like yeah, we, we do need some, some mayhem. Was it mayhem? Oh, shit! Does the kid die too? I can't remember. Eat the kid, piranhas, eat him. The government paid you? Sometimes. Yeah, sometimes. sometimes Not often. Warfare. Our place, we can pretty much just talk at each other <laughs> wherever we are. Um. Kill the kid. I mean, I will. There will be times where, where, where we've had, like, an argument. Oh, that's And then true. I will text him later. Um, because sometimes I have a hard time when I'm angry calming down and not being an asshole and talking to him like an asshole. Um, so sometimes I text him so that I don't have to say anything and I can, I can get my thoughts together and text and then tell him what's going on and, you know, all this other stuff. So I do that sometimes when I can't, when I feel like I can't, uh, get what I need to say out verbally. So. Well, that makes a lot of sense, Marilyn. If you have headphones on all the time, then yeah. Sometimes Will's in his office with his headphones on. Yeah. And I will message him then to, to talk to him. Yeah. We developed a lot of and then there are other times where he has headphones on and I'll just come in and interrupt him. Like yeah, and scare time. the fuck out of me. Okay, well, when you have your headphones on, I don't have a choice. Like, know. there's no way I can get your attention without scaring the shit out of you. Wild species. So. Suddenly there were hundreds. Yeah. Maybe thousands. Oh, thanks. Yeah, thanks, Spooky. Well, yeah, hey! Sometimes, sometimes it really helps. Spooky Nights, what's up? Hey, Spooky Nights. How are you guys? I don't talk to anyone. Caskets, you're talking to us right now. You're talking to a lot of people right now. By the way, everyone, uh, Spooky Nights uh, has their own uh, really awesome uh, YouTube channel where they um, do ghost hunting and uh, explore places and all that good stuff so you know we know you guys like that stuff so uh check out their channel because they're awesome i can't say anything about being an asshole i don't know are you Oh, Marilyn and Kaskis are going to be friends. Yay. Everybody just put your phone number in the text right now. Nope. <laughs> Don't do that. In the chat. 1-900. You fed them. You kept them alive. I continued the experiment. There was so much more I could do with the species. So much further There's I could so much more I can do with the species. You're not holding me responsible. Oh, there you go. Yeah. So it's a. It's I a, think you are. It happens. You pulled the plug. I don't think there's anything the wrong with it. You know. Incredible. Especially if you You're know nowadays me. everybody's one nine hundred horny. That's right. Again, nowadays, up. like you know, we're all doing you stuff. It's so easier to text. Yeah, no problems with you, nights. Yeah, I imagine probably a lot of people do it. I imagine my parents probably don't do it. No, I doubt. I doubt that. Yeah. Oh, the kid's alive. <laughs> You're upset. <laughs> Daddy? No, I'm pretty sure your dad's dead, kid. Yeah, your dad is is food. Don't do it! Get out of there! 
Come on, baby. Oh. Oh, that's so nice. Our right, shit's finally like going down. So I'm trying to pay attention. Oh, I, I love that. They look like just like <laughs> paper cutouts or cardboard cutouts. Yeah, shit's finally popping off. Ah! ah! No! I love the noise they make. Jean jacket. Come on. Hey, he needs You're it. never gonna get the blood out of there. Yeah, and also we're never gonna get her to take that ugly vest off. No, she's wearing that the whole movie. She's like, no, I'm keeping it. Damn, he died with the eyes wide open. Damn, if you would have just gave him your fucking oh, vest, he would have lived. He would have lived with the <laughs> vest. Trevor, Where'd they shoot this? Did they shoot this in California? I don't know. Let's see. Dude died for the kid, weak as fuck. Right? Fuck that. You're an old drunk man. You need to. You need to live. Is it just me or does his like keys on his like necklace thing look like a rosary? It's like weird looking. Uh, I have to look at it. This again. was the dumbest idea they've had. Like here, yeah, we'll. Just... Look at this traumatized child sitting next to a dead body. So far, we know that. Look, like, I hate to be that person, but it, would, would it be such a bad idea to just push him into the water? Film this in Texas. Okay. San Marcos. Oh, great. Well, now his bleeding hand is in the water. And California, too. Oh, look at this. Well, we're missing it. The kid? No, no, no. Oh. His look. Oh, yeah! Fuck your boat! The stupid... <laughs> the, the guy who just died, his hand is in the water, and it's bloody, and it's attracting the fucking piranhas. He typically live longer... Then drunk, so I'm okay with this. <laughs> what about a drunk kid? Oh. Mm -hmm. There's something under us. What if that kid is uh, a future serial killer? Mm -hmm. You never know. Mm -hmm. <laughs> like, I don't mean to be that person, but I feel like they wouldn't attack this shit because it's not weird. No, of course. It Look, yeah, there's a lot of... Oh, look, I also know that piranhas don't eat live shit. Yeah. They only eat dead things. There's a lot of logic that you have to just let go of for this movie. I feel like this guy wants to just yell, you stupid bitch, in this lazy face every time. Oh, he yeah. Goes. Yeah, fucking throw him. They're eating him. Well, yeah, that's what they wanted. What, what are, are you doing, doing kid? Come here. It's some dude you never met. Yeah. They'll be they'll be tired after they eat the old man and the kid. I loved him so. Straight edge kids live longer than pickled punks. Pickled punks. That's yeah, fucking you know, great. You know this would have probably worked better if you I don't know had a boat. They that's all they could get. Well, then maybe they shouldn't have gone in the water. They needed to. I still forget what the fuck it is they're doing. Are they looking for people? I mean, I think like, now... What are they doing? I think now they're just trying to tell people about the piranhas. And, well, they had to save the kid, and now they're just trying to get the information the out kid there. in the next... Yeah, has less to worry about. The strange kids live longer than pickle punks. You okay, boy? That's true. How many straight-edge kids grow up and start doing drugs and alcohol, well, though? Well, my other point was it's like... I'm okay with not living super long at this point. Jesus. 
Well, no, I don't mean that. I just mean, like, you know, it's not getting any cooler. <laughs> we have air conditioning. <laughs> Is this a sign that they'll actually, like, fucking look at? I also have never been one of those people that I'm like, I want to live to be a hundred. Like, I don't, that, I don't want that life. I became straight yeah. in my elder days. Marilyn did it back, did it the other way. There was a certain point in my teenage years that I, that I thought I was gonna be straight edge. Acres and acres no, of land nestled in yeah, and then I found marijuana. I will live to be a hundred and fourteen. I hope so, Marilyn. I hope you're like a cool ass old lady that's like, hey kids, you ever heard of Mr. Bungle? <laughs> Check this shit out. Yeah, and then the kids are like, oh, you mean circus ska? <laughs> and then she goes into a fucking rage. She throws her walker, and she's like, come the fuck on! Don't, don't Fight fuck me. with me! Whatever you do, don't open it. Ah, I think you're right, Cascus. Yeah! My wife, she didn't care about getting old, so she died a long time ago. <laughs> and I'm just hanging out with my dog now. Waiting for the apocalypse. The dream, oh my god. <laughs> Be drunk on a dock with his dog. Yep. <laughs> no sign of me at all. Hey, you're the one that's like, I don't care about living to, that long, so... I said I didn't want to live to be a hundred. I think that's fair. You forgive our skepticism, Mr. Grogan. Oh. Don't I don't know if we're built like for that, to be completely honest. There's some people that are, like, way man. into the hundreds. I, and I'm not, uh, again, and I'm not, I, I didn't say that that, that was, like, she a super good thing. She was skank until the day she dies. Ready with that bait, soldier? Yes, sir. Let it go, son. Old ass Marilyn at the ska show in the pit. Actually, Piranha was caught once in the pond in Miami in '72, I believe. Are you serious? Pizza Hut gives out free pizza if you're a hundred. That was that. Gotta keep going in for eyes. I think if you're a hundred, every restaurant should give you free food. In this area. Piranha travel in schools, and we brought heavy doses of rotin on too. You are too pure. Well prepared, He's fucking you. Oh. You the river? <laughs> I'm gullible, that's true. At least with people I trust and are my friends. That's the thing. You just abused my trust, Laz. That's what it is. I'm not too pure. You're fucking gaslighting me about Pizza Hut. You're making me look forward to my next step, step 60, six years waiting for free pizza. Damn, I really wanted that to be true. See? Look, me and Marilyn. I mean, hell, they might. God. We need to start, we need to petition them. Pizza Hut, look. Yeah. There's a person that's a hundred, they get a free pizza, okay? They probably would agree. Just how it is. Be like, back. sure. Here. We are here at the van, okay? Now look over here and you'll see. Old people need greasy, system. fucking okay. saucy fun we'll as well. Greasy, saucy fun. <laughs> greasy, saucy fun. Yeah. Yeah. Let's have some greasy, saucy like, fun. I feel like that describes more than one thing in your life. Next, yes. Next time we order pizza, that's how I'm going to say it. Don't you do You want to have some greasy, saucy fun? Don't you think we should do something? This woman! She looks very evil. Piranha have neither the intelligence nor the motivation to find it. But you know what? Alright, wait a second. It's not her fault. And then she does the crazy eyes. she does the wide eyed Oh shit! Good night, Buster. Good night, Bill. You knew him? I will make sure I have pizza for my hundredth birthday. Hundred-year-old <laughs> dies from ingesting pizza. <laughs> greasy saucy bun. No greasy saucy. Fun. There you go. I, yeah, I was saying fun. You're saying fun. The greasy saucy <laughs> bun. I like that. Is it waxman? Are you afraid of what? Oh my God! What? Well, I'm not what? Afraid. 
I'm a scientist. Yes! <laughs> Done! Marilyn, now shoot, email me all of your friends' <laughs> information. <laughs> I'll say, look, you like you love Marilyn, right? Okay, okay. Well, then you're gonna well, then you're gonna, you're gonna fuck in, on on camera, oh my God. so we can give Marilyn the great the greatest it. birthday present ever. You had to take it to that level. And say oh my God, it. saying fuck is terrible. It depends on the context. What you that's true in a PG-13 movie say, as... you cannot say fuck in a sexual context no, and that's what I was going to say because the rating for it can you bring in uh, a water for me please yeah please thank you trust me it's a thoughtful gift yeah <laughs> just a stranger coming at you The bottom of this is weird. Oh, okay. That is the opening line. <laughs> is he still out there? Yup. I'm just distracting. Why? So I can get away. So you can get away? What about me? So you're gonna be a poor. Trust me, it's a thoughtful gift. No. Yeah. Before every scene, they'll both look into the camera and say, Marilyn, you're such a great friend, and we really love you, and we this hope is for you. this is for you. <laughs> and then zoom out, and they're naked, and they just start going at it. Oh my god, why are you going to do this? Because I always got to take a joke all the way till it's uh, dead. <laughs> That's until everyone's uncomfortable. Yeah, until everybody goes, stop. Stop it. Please just stop. Are you gay? What? Oh. Well, I was just reading this article in this magazine, and... Uh, what did you ask me before? <laughs> up in the sky! It's Superman! Whoa! Oh, that was different boobs. That was not her boobs. Boob double. God, direct eye contact with the drone. The oh, God! <laughs> See, now that's a step. Oh, that's too far for you. Not, okay, I would not. I, I just feel like it would be weird to be to watch a porn and then the, the actors just staring in the camera the whole time. Those stunt boobs. Stunt boobs. Are you this guy's got a weird this? fucking like uh, bedroom. Yeah. yeah. Well, I remember you. You're not crazy. You're drunk. You're no, drunk. I don't want to talk to her. I'm sure she's as drunk as you are. You wake me up again, I'll have the cops on you. Dogs tear up, newborn oh, This baby. is for me, no, not careful. you, Will. Okay. Look. So All right, Marilyn, okay. I'll make sure. Did you, did you hear what I said? No, what'd you say? Dogs tear up, newborn baby. That's what the fucking thing says. Jesus Christ! Yeah. Asshole. He didn't believe you. He thinks I'm drunk. Will doesn't hear anything. Can I you get through to I do door? hear what you say. No way. And then they all fuck like starving animals. Will, that's too far. <laughs> that's, that's... That's me. That is cool. Oh shit. Did you just drip beer? No. I dropped my bottle cap. Oh. Man, there's really not enough piranha. Nope. This man is sleeping in a child's bed. He is. Yeah. <laughs> uh, Cascus, that's right. perfect. That's so funny. And this one's for from? you. An army test site up on the mountain. That's posted up there. There's no press pass. Posted or not, two people have been killed up there, and more have been killed all along but the river. You gotta believe us. Oh, now, wait. Say, aren't you Brogan? <laughs> yeah, that's right. <laughs> uh, I remember. You're just like, like yes, yes. I am not drunk. Damn you should just you go through your ring thing, thing and be like, I appreciate you. I hope I hope <laughs> someone at home it's... does as well. It would scare the shit out of me. Just like, say a compliment, but in the weirdest possible way. And do it like right as they're about to like walk away. Yeah. Before they even hey. expect it. Hey, turn around. Hey. You're, you're really great, and I appreciate you bringing me my food. Yeah, said can. thanks, man, once he yeah, fell down. down. And you can help us out here by holding the ball. Yes, 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 I understand. So I don't do it anymore. Uh, 
We're trying to avoid They're probably not sorry, expecting man. anyone to say Certainly. anything, so... This is... Luke, this is definitely... Yeah, this is definitely not one of Joe's finest films. It was his first, though, I think. I'm pretty sure this was his first film. <laughs> you alright? See you in the morning. <coughs> yeah, shit. Could very, I could very well be wrong, but. What is it, snack? It is. Oh, read what it says on the package. So it says fried pungent bean curd. Fried pungent bean curd. It, it sounds terrible, but it's not. It's very good. It's just tofu. It's been like marinated and stuff. It's really good. I want to say it has seaweed on it too, but I have no idea. I don't nope. think it does. Okay. Packet goo? No. Packet goo. It's a little piece, oh. like I said, it's a little piece of marinated tofu. That's about all. So Joe Dante made two films before this, Hollywood Boulevard, and then his first movie was called The Movie Orgy. Okay. Where is he? The cover of it's fucking weird. Oh, a compilation. I love a saucy tofu. I love a saucy tofu, too. Yeah. Good, just leave it there. I like that. Excellent. <laughs> <laughs> there he is. I know. I would wanna. I would wanna fuck with the, the delivery person. And be like, oh yeah, that's real good. And they'd be like, oh. Yeah, move it to the left. I don't wanna fucking make anyone uncomfortable, but it would still be really funny. Yeah. I think it would be great if they played along. <laughs> well, look, I, it would make I really me laugh. The that's for sure. Hey, Dick Miller. Yeah. Uh, don't worry. <laughs> whenever anyone goes along, has any? <laughs> Sorry. When, whenever uh, anyone goes along with any of my jokes, I'm always surprised. So. Ah, good. good has good. anyone Presents seen the, the uh, clip? Mm -hmm. I believe it was okay. an outtake from The Burbs, uh, okay. where Dick Miller. They're about to start a scene, no, and I think Corey Haim's no fucking around, question. and Dick Miller's like, "Fucking stop it, kid. Really We're here to work. Like, like let's let's, let's go." I'm like, <laughs> it's such a great clip. I fucking love it. <laughs> like he's like, I don't have time for this shit. Yeah, he's like, it's just he's, a, he's like, everybody else loves you, but fuck you. I'm here to do a job. I'm a professional. Hey, come on, you guys, with your whole ass, this stuff's gonna be set by ten o'clock. Dude, oh, yeah, yeah, it's so great. It's right, such so a great they clip. They drink beer and they hide. Yes, we miss you, Dick. Oh, spicy. That's a spicy tofu. I always like it at night. You just show me that clip. Yeah, I will. Too. I will later. It's like it's resting. Hey, you want to race me, Fred? To the island? Yeah. Ever since I got here, I haven't been able to just swim by myself. And my voice had half a dozen campers hanging on to me. Oh, yeah, because it's your job. I don't yeah. know. I don't really feel much like that. But go ahead, I'll watch it. She's gonna strip down right in front of this woman and, and get into the goddamn Sweeter. water, isn't she? I don't know. I don't know. Yeah. Something's wrong. Come on, why don't you go with me? It'll do you some Right? Time. Yeah. You know, you probably will. Right. It's very <laughs> character focused. Rogan, Whoa! Don't be alarmed, baby. It's only me. There's a rumor some of the campers are coming down here for midnight swims. Well, if I, I mean, catch any of them swimming, so this 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 has brought something into my mind. What are you doing? Oh, well, we. Why I are I heard like? Some campers I guess I know the answer to this, yeah. but it seems like women are much more comfortable being naked or partially naked around one another. Yes. Is that where they're doing because it? Because we're not taught to. What was that? To believe uh, that if you see if like another not, person or another girl naked that you're gay. Yeah, like it's, it, it, for men, it becomes this weird, like, gay sexual thing. Yeah, and it's Where it's girl, not you? like that, you're just naked. Yeah, because girls have this maturity well, about it of, that hey, we both have the yeah. same shit. Yeah. It looks different, because we're different. Yeah. But that's it. So yeah, girls are mature about it. Guys are just like, oh, it's another dick, get away from me. Yeah, like, pretty much. It's like, like, they think they're gonna, like, Get it on them or something. It's Get fucking. It on them. It's just the weirdest thing. Like you're gonna catch it. Like yeah. I don't know what the fuck. What it's now? the weirdest thing. Did I ever tell you about Mo Schneider? They had five dollars. <laughs> she is breaking a lot of shit in this movie. Yeah, this girl breaks shit, and it's and it's kind of entertaining. What the fuck? They have five dollars. Hey, what are you doing there? 
I'm gonna flood, flood it. So many times she's gonna flood herself. So she can it's weird because she's like smart, but also really stupid. Okay, what are you doing now? Are you all right? This, this, uh, this You asked about their comfort. Okay, well that's good. No. Oh. I mean, I feel it's almost. I never trust a naked man. I mean, I've 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 never had to be a thing. You know what I'm saying? Like, like, were you? Did you get? You but you got naked around your friends at some point, right? Yeah, and it was mostly because we were all changing clothes. Yeah, at the same time. it was not. It was like nothing. It was and just also, like, well, also, I've been a model. Yeah. And when you're a model, you have to like change clothes really quick. Yeah. And you know, but for the most part, when I was a model, I had nude undergarments. Okay. But sometimes you can't wear undergarments a certain thing. Yeah. So, so that would happen. But it's just nobody. Just gets it. It's just nobody is paying attention. Fucking right, Luke. <laughs> everyone, wa everyone should watch Women in Love. It's a great movie, and there is a naked fight sequence that involves Oliver Reed. Two men naked on? wrestling. Get his keys. Can you get his keys? Which I believe Ken Russell like. Pants kind of had them drink a little bit before the scene, I think. So that so they would be more loosened up about fighting naked. More naked, more naked fights in general like fucking Vigo and Eastern Promises. I feel like I feel like I've never I feel like I've never needed to check for someone's comfort level because everyone else is doing the same thing. Yeah. So I get you. Yeah. I've never been in a situation Yes, where... exactly, Laz, yeah. But I do understand the the, the need and, and the, the courtesy to ask somebody else, but... Dude, if for some reason I got into a fight with somebody, or a fight was about to start, and then they just stripped down, like, to be naked, I would be like, dude, never mind. Like, <laughs> That's a good way to get out of a fight. Yeah. I'm not gonna fight you naked. Um. Oh, I'm sure he had to twist Oliver Reed's arm to get drunk and naked. That's that's a good point. Luke. <laughs> oh, Luke. Speaking of, um, I recently picked up the the House of the Usher or the House of Usher, uh, Edgar Allan Poe uh, uh, adaptation that has Oliver Reed in the starring role. I'm excited to watch it. My ex best friend got mad at me for topless sunbathing several years ago, and that was the first time I realized it could make oh. a close friend uncomfortable. I understand. That just, that, Mar that seems a little, to me, that seems a little overboard. Marilyn, you can come and topless sunbathe over at our place anytime you want, and we will be just fine. No, I'm just saying. I will, I will go away while you do that. You and, you and Marilyn can, can do that together. I, I to well, yeah, I know. I, I'm not, what's talking about you? I was talking about like, you. Like, hi guys, how you yeah. doing? But I'm saying, like, I can understand why that would make someone uncomfortable. That probably wouldn't make me uncomfortable. My whole thing would just be like, oh, she's like, she's comfortable enough to do this. Yeah. My only worry would just be other people seeing you and like gawking or saying something. That would be my only like, like thing I'd be worried about. But. Look at these big ass scissors. Other than that, I, you know, I wouldn't have an issue with it. But I do understand how some people could like maybe not be okay with it. I think your ex friend was being a little too much. But I do, Marilyn. I do kind of agree. I think your your ex friend was maybe a little bit jealous. Yeah. Maybe just a tiny Something. bit. Something. But. Oh, Lone Star! Yeah, Luke. I just saw that. Man, we're gonna have us some good shiner beer for the uh, Texas Chainsaw. Event. There we. Thank you, Luke. Yes, Luke and I will topless sunbathe. Yes. And go hunting for VHSs. <laughs> My boobs existing? Yeah, and see, that's the thing, is that... I would never do that to you. What the fuck? I would, I feel like... I think she was just mad about my boobs, like, that's just existing. Funny. We talked about it's it later, and she just said, I would never do that to you. I think she's... Do like, that? I think you're... I think she's your ex-best friend for a reason. Yeah. She's got some hang-ups. And you know, I'm, it's not like I haven't had friends who are girls who have gotten the same way with me about certain things. And I'm just like, I don't understand the issue. I'm sorry. Look, if I went to a lake with, with some friends, mm -hmm. and a friend of mine just got naked and got in the lake... I would not have a problem with it. I'd be like, that's cool, dude. You do your thing, man. Yeah. 
I mean, Will's been to a, to I've a been nude to, beach. Yeah, I went to a nude with, beach with, with twice. a friend. Yeah. You know? Yeah, it's. Will's very much not afraid to to get naked. No. Situa situationally. It feels kind of good. It's kind of liberating, you know? Marilyn, I think you I get mad when boobs Marilyn, exist. like I said, I think that was purely a jealousy thing. I think she was really upset that you, or, were, that you were comfortable with your body and she isn't. Or she liked what she saw and got weird and about got it. And got uncomfortable? Yeah. That's always that's always a possibility for sure. I get mad when boobs Be so nude all day, just a foot or so away. I just remembered it. Is that, is that a song? Are those lyrics? Part of the test set. No, I think uh, I think Laz just said that. <laughs> I remember the, what I read something recently um, about Jack Nicholson went to, tried to be a nudist back in the '60s, and apparently Roger Corman came over and he was like Roger was very upset by it. <laughs> but Harry Dean Stanton fucking loved to come over and just be naked. That's <laughs> me. I have no idea. It's your song now, Laz. Oh, I want it. I really want the prickly pear shiner. Oh, yeah, me too. We only get... Where we go, We there's only three types of shiner. But so we're maybe we should check some other places. We're still really excited, though, to, to try it. Oh, we're going to see Texas Chainsaw Massacre on 35mm this upcoming Thursday, and they're going to have three different uh, shiner beers along with the barbecue that yep. they're serving, so... Yep. Hopefully, maybe. That would be fucking sweet if there was one, because they said they have a dessert beer, I think. Okay. That would be awesome. Um, I'm also dressing up for it, so keep an eye out for pictures from that event. Oh, so am I, actually. Oh, yeah, and Will's actually dressing up, too. Hell, yeah. I don't normally do it, but I came up with an idea that I thought was pretty good. Thank you. Yeah, I hope they're I hope they're good. You know, it's funny. Danny's drinking Shiner right now. I don't I know if you showed everybody. Shiner, yeah. The, the uh, sea, salt sea salt and lime. Yeah. That's my favorite so far that I've had from them. It's easy to drink. Yes, Marilyn, drive down. It's gonna be a fucking awesome night. Yeah, I mean, like. Yes. Seriously. That's what I think, Cass. Cause that's that's what it sounds like to me. But that's just that's just from the small amount of info that we've been given. I mean, no shade to your ex best friend. I, I just mean. think anybody who's that uptight about nudity, it's like. You know, we all we're all born naked. Chill the fuck out. Also, speaking, you know, as as a as a lady, as a lady, um, <laughs> you know, boobs. I mean, in the right in a context, yeah. can be sexualized for me, but in most situations, they're boobs. Boobs, boobs have no sexual yeah. connotation to me. They don't, you know. I have a yeah. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. So. They're very normal, so yeah. yeah if, if one of my friends got her boobs out, again, situa <laughs> again, situationally, like if we were just chilling in my house and then she like just took her top off, I, that would be a little strange. But I mean, if we're if we're out by the pool sunbathing and shit, then that makes sense. You know what I'm saying? What are you gonna say? So Laz just said Jesus liked being nude. Loose enough. Do you think that if Jesus? went over to some water and like tapped his penis in it. It would turn it would turn. <laughs> what is wrong with you? You're a fucking moron. I, so the rest of the trip Why I, not? I heard, oh wait. When I went on spring break at my friend's beach house my female friends were uncomfortable with my alley getting naked in front of them. So the rest of the trip I heard them as loudly <laughs> I heard them loudly yell at her asking if she was trans. What the fuck? God damn it, I love <laughs> it's a, it's It's something to think about. Jesus turned water into moonshine with his cock. Yes. Does this guy have a gun? He does have a gun. I thought it looked like he had a fucking gun on his belt earlier. Okay. Maybe I'm wrong about that, but I, I got a sense. Yes! Oh! Yes! Oh, it's biting the kid's feet! Do it, Luke. I'm Luke! I'm doing my dick one now. 
And yes, we're talking about dick flying. Also, I'm flying down from the TFC <laughs> Do it, man. Luke, you fly here for that. I will fly to Pennsylvania so we can go see the Argento shit at the drive-in. Hey. Uh, dude, if I had extra money, I'd fucking do it. I know. I would, I would buy tickets. We'd go, Luke. We'd rent a fucking car. It would be the best. Um, why would kind of the water would lose it? I know, right? <laughs> um, I mean, yeah, it's... Yes, it would be so we, great. We're so excited about the, uh, about the Texas Chainsaw. Dude, I never thought it ever, like, to, seeing Texas Chainsaw on film, like, I didn't think that would ever happen. It's just such an uh, older film, I feel like get, seeing a print that's worthy of being shown. Because I've been to... I went to a Herschel Gordon Lewis uh, fest thing where they showed a few of his movies on film. And they showed Blood Feast. Great, great uh, print. Looked great. And then they showed um, Color Me Blood Red. And it was so faded. They also showed 2000 Maniac. So faded. There was, like, hardly any color to the print. And I was like, you guys are showing this? This is a horrible print. You shouldn't be showing this. I guess they were like, you know, we found it, but we can show it. But it just looked bad. And I know Majestic is not going to do that. No. So I, I can't wait to see what the print looks like. I know, it's so sad. Yeah. I'm pretty sure a kid, a kid is gonna die. If they haven't already died. Oh no, her friend's uh -oh. gonna die. Oh uh, yeah, I think she's gone. Oh no! Oh, she goes. Sucked right down. Right? Wrong kid just, died. Just gonna pull out her arm. Oh, I feel bad. I like that lady. Damn. Traumatized. Ugh. She was just a camp counselor trying to help. Text chain so would be awesome. I saw Tristan last week at the drive theater and I was Oh like, well, that's Eric, cool. hell yeah, dude. That, that sounds, sounds great. That sounds fun. If I watch Twi Twister again, I want it to be Twitter. on the big screen. Twicker. 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 <laughs> that doesn't sound like that menacing as Twister. It <laughs> Whenever we see a little dust devil when we're driving out, like it's the smallest little tunnel, you know, and we drive through it, I'm like, we just drove through a fucking Twister. Yeah. And Danny hates it, I think. Well, to be fair, <laughs> the giant dick had with socks and sandals uh, yeah. was saving children. It doesn't matter. Oh, okay. She shouldn't have died. I mean, I agree. But... God damn you, Joe. You're doing that just to twist the hearts of the audience. Look at the giant pig! Pig. Look at this shit. Phone and a suitcase. Now listen to me. I've never seen one of those in real life. I really want to. I am completely serious. Emergency? Easy. Easy. I like how the movie, it takes like almost half the movie, then it just becomes Jaws. Please. Please, you gotta believe me. Thank you. Listen to me! Look, please, the fort's... Thank you. I have to run. Oh my god, that's so cool! It's like the best possible way to see any movie. At a drive-in with fucking fireworks going off behind or in the distance. We're gonna have to drive to the resort ourselves. Sit down, sit down. Can you handle this? Uh, no. Shoot him. Why? Oh, dead kid. Oh, dead kid. I'll be back for you real soon. Brave, huh? Oh, that would have been great. That would I I actually funny thing I will I don't want to watch Jaws ever again okay. because I saw a revival of Jaws on film at the Charles in Baltimore, and it was such a cool, awesome experience that I was like, I'm 
I'm good. That's the best way I'll ever watch Jaws. Here we go. Here comes the mayhem. Here's a bunch of 70s butts and boobs. Not too shabby. You're spilling your beer everywhere, dude. 70s butts cool. Yeah. Lone Star shirt. Lone Star really like paid for this movie, I guess. Oh man, maybe I don't want to see Argento on film then. <laughs> no, I'll still watch the. Uh, you know what? I don't know, man. That's just me. It was just such a great experience that I just was like, uh, I don't know if that can be beat. Ralph, the swimming swine. I don't know if I can, like, never watch Argento films again, though, if I saw them on the screen. They're just great and so much fun. Thank you! They are. The one thing that sucks, though, is that they're showing, they're not showing Phenomena, they're showing the U.S. cut, Creepers. I've never watched that cut because I don't think it's going to be good. Um, but that's the one thing that I kind of sucked about seeing the Argento stuff. The pain of 70 shorts, yeah. I'm glad I never had shorts that, that, uh, short. <laughs> I once dated a guy who wore uh, shorts that short, but they were a bathing suit. He wore a bathing suit? Just as shorts? No, I mean, like, when we, like, went Oh, okay, okay. I was gonna say, that's a bit weird. You got your orders, Mr. Hoptoy. They call it with military crap. Will you come? I'll take care of it. With me? Sir. Let's uh, hop to it. General Waxman, it's been so long. It's Colonel, man. Oh, Colonel, still. Then oh, why? The politics. <laughs> <laughs> that lady's great. Stupid cow. Ooh. Whoa. Throw your drink at him, lady. He also popularized being an asshole. No, he didn't. <laughs> yeah, do a fucking jump or something, man. Oh, yeah, we should have had this with Sopranos. Right. Too many jean shirts for me. <laughs> a big boat! I knew it! That's it. <laughs> You're right. Scuba diving Henry. near where boats are is a really stupid idea. Well, if you're far down enough, the boat's not going to reach you at all. These, the, this place, like where they're diving, does not seem very deep at all. It doesn't seem that deep, that's true. I'm just saying, you take a fucking uh, boat propeller to the head and that's it. Good night. Oh, the reefs got me. Oh my god. Yeah, you're supposed to secure all that shit before you fucking die. So I will tell everybody right now, if you have not seen the remake of Piranha, way faster than this. Lots more killing and stuff, so... I, if, if, if this isn't the movie you wanted, I think the remake might be. Uh, oh, shit. That's kind of a bad idea. Like, he's like, oh, shit! Yeah. My oh, God, what are you doing to me? Yes! 
Yeah. Um. Hold it. There's something back fuck, here. Is Alexander Aja or whatever, dude that made High Tension. Oh. He also made the remake of this. Of course, he was gonna put lots more boobs and blood in it. I would not want to do this because the whole like having both of your feet like yeah. crisscrossed on one little teeny plank, I don't like that. They're not gonna be able to hear you. Like no matter what. They're not gonna be able to yeah. hear you. Yeah! Oh no, you're gonna kill me! Wait! <laughs> oh, that's a bad idea. <laughs> no, keep going. She's like, make up your mind! Now he's saying stop? Oh shit. Oh! oh. It blew up before he hit it! It blew up right before he hit it! Kicks into action an hour and twenty minutes in. What the hell just happened? <laughs> Ooh, that water looks fucking gross. Yeah, I would not want to just lay in that water. You guys have fun in that area. I'm gonna go down to the swampy bit. It's like when I see people swimming. In the <laughs> what are you laughing about? The editing of that. Oh no, went right up his shorts. Oh, for real? Yes! These people are kind of kids. They're like teenagers. Hey, this is reading the summary vibes I was looking for, and so there's an excellent conversation feel for the majority of its runtime. Yes. These are the positives. Yes. I'm not gonna make a butt eating joke! Who brings Moby Dick to the fucking beach, by the way? I don't know. I feel that's too on the nose. <laughs> well, the movie opens up with somebody, I mean, not opens up, but you see the person playing the Jaws video game. It's a little wink wink. I want a newborn baby to fall into that water, Laz! Oh my god. That is fucking ruthless. Look, I just miss when movies put kids in dangerous situations. <laughs> Because it's, it's more like real life, you know, kids are in dangerous situations all the time. When you're young and go fucking do crazy adventures that you probably shouldn't. Give them at the beach, <laughs> Les. Oh, oh man, it went for the nipple. Of course, I gotta do this, right? Yeah. Look, Corman is not a stupid man. Nudity and gore. Cowards. <laughs> yeah. I really want to give birth to my baby in salt water. Can we do that? In dirty salt water. Oh! Ow! I don't like that shot. Sure. The feet? The foot? Damn it, get off! What? Damn it, get off! Come on, Colonel! Oh, shit! Oh yeah, get sand all in, in, in your fucking wounds. You don't really have a choice. Yeah. Damn 
do it? People do it with the dolphins? Really? Oh, yeah, man. Yeah, they do. There's, you can do that. What is something I heard of recently? Free birth? Was it called free birth? I don't know. Yeah, eat him! Eat that asshole! Luke, you're probably right. Have you seen that trick? I don't remember it that well. Luke has been making me want to go through Penn and Teller's bullshit, though. I haven't watched it in a long time. I love that show. We just watched the Dolphins episode of yes. It's such a fun... I love bullshit. It's so funny. Give birth while skydiving. Like God intended. Laz, what are you going to give birth to, buddy? <laughs> <laughs> you're just going to take a shit while you're skydiving? <laughs> As close as are I don't know, maybe Laz has a uterus. I don't know. That's about as close as you guys are going to get to it. It'll be much tight when they come through there. As close as that is. What's that? If it isn't capped off, there might be enough waste left in the smelling tanks. It'll kill the fish? It'll kill anything. Oh, great. We'll pollute the bastards to death. We'll pollute them to death. Yeah, that's great. Just pollute the fucking lake. <laughs> Underwater. Well, it looks like you gotta swim. Well, we gotta do something. Where's that tow line? It's in the back. What was that? Shit. Did that stop fucking, uh... No, that's stupid. I'm not gonna make that joke. Never mind. Then whether I'm up to the surface or not... <laughs> no. You hit no. The fuck I'm it. not gonna do Step that. Out of here. I'm not up by then. It means I'm in trouble because that's as long as I can hold my breath. So... Count it down together. Okay. Her jeans are like really in her butt. Did you see that? Two, no. Three, Three four, four, five, six, seven. I'm not even sure they regret. I don't understand, but we could use a 22 version. You know what? I would. I would like that. I would. I would watch another Piranha movie. I mean, truthfully, I haven't seen the direct sequel to this one, but even though this one kind of is slow in the beginning, I do enjoy this movie, and I enjoyed Piranha and Piranha 3 Double D. <laughs> the Piranha sequel was in 3D when it came out in the theaters. Yeah, but it has to be called Double D. Yeah, because there's boobs in it, so of course. Gross. That was the last hurrah of, like sex films. Yeah, I mean, Like, we don't really get any more, like, yeah, this film is so you can see boobs and sex and stuff. That's kind of stopped at this point. 49. There's no more sex comedies. There's no more none of that stuff. Sex comedies, I do miss. I know, I miss a good sex comedy, man. You know what's a good... You ever see Trojan War? The old 90s movie with... Uh, Jennifer Love Hewitt is one of her first things, and the whole thing is... The guy, this girl that he really likes, is like, let's have sex, but he doesn't have a condom. And the whole movie is, is him trying to get, to get a condom so he no. can have sex with this girl that he really likes, but then he realizes that he really loves Jennifer Love Hewitt. That sounds nice. I like it. I, th I liked it when I was younger. Oh, awesome. Thank you, Ms. Cox. Yes! Well, the internet happened. Yeah, That's exactly. true. It's That's like, true. There's no need for that. You could get it. That's true. That's true. The internet was a great place before social media. Was it though? I think so. Like, message boards. Like, a lot of people on message boards. I think you're really forgetting about the, like, bad side of the internet. Well, there is a bad side of the internet, yes. But I, I used to be on message boards before social media, and people were generally cool. 
Like, not a lot of people really were assholes. I, that is not true. From my experience, but also, you know, I'm a do to. You know, I'm sure it might be different for, for women. No, I'm not making it about that. Oh. I'm saying, just because you haven't experienced that side of the internet, sure doesn't mean that it's not so. Sure, I'm talking from my experience. Yeah. Jesus. Which is limited. You know, you don't have a tendency to go to the dark web or explore other, you know. I have no. I would not want to go to the dark web. I don't understand that, but that's what I'm saying. I was on like CKY message boards. Yeah. Like I wasn't like on anything. I'm saying, I'm saying you're on surface level. Yes, yes. Internet. Yes. This is the stupidest thing. But you know, he's with fine. The, with the fucking, uh, he music. got bit up about as much as some of the other people. So so I, I don't know. He got bit up as much as Sock Sandal Dude. I haven't really enjoyed this very much. No? Sorry. It's fine. I've been enjoying the conversation and shit, but this is really kind of take it or leave it for me. This is really middle of the fucking road. I don't feel any sort of way towards it. Oh shit! Oh! Lost River Lake. Terror? Hi, I'm from PBS. Ugh. Oh shit! The gore effects hold up. Mm -hmm. They're pretty like, oh, that looks like it hurts a lot. Aww. She's holding the booze canteen. She is holding the booze canteen. Well, give yourself another 15 years, little girl. You'll be fucking right on that booze, too. <laughs> this is traumatic. CKY Alliance, hell yeah. That is a giant camera. Holy shit. She's done crying now. Oh no, she's crying some more. Here, give him his alcohol. Just put a little on his lips. He'll come back to life. Go from here, Dr. <laughs> well, yeah. It's not the bites that are getting him, it's the withdrawal. Yeah. Give yeah. it to him. He hasn't had whiskey in four hours. Fucking start shaking and shit. I swear I know this woman. What has she been in? She's not Ilsa, is she? There's nothing left to fear. Oh! Wait, is that the end of the movie? Wow, that woman is like if an emu became a woman. Is this the end of the movie? Yep, look. Holy shit! Piranha has a fucking downer fucking ending. That's Jesus that's Christ! A really, that's a bleak ending. Wow! Okay, I, I think that pushes it up for me now. I, that it has such a bleak-ass ending. Barbara Steele. What was Barbara Steele in? Oh, Black Sunday. Okay. Shivers. Okay, all right. We used to try and gather up as many AOL discs as possible and hang out in chat rooms online. <laughs> I did something very different with the AOL discs. I was very destructive with the AOL discs. Especially if that town serves lunch. <laughs> <laughs> well, there you go, guys. Piranha. Oh, Piranha. F Phil Tippett! Yes! Cool. I didn't know he worked on this. Kool-Aid credits. I think a bit slow, for sure, but uh, I think the end really, really pushes this up. Especially that fucking, like, evil stare that she gives at the end there. This feels very Carrie. Yeah, right? It does. Well, Carrie came out a year or two before this, right? Uh, you would know. Carrie was 76? 77? Eric Stoner. Yeah, Eric. Fucker. <laughs> Carrie was 76, yeah. 5 out of 10 Ian Marquita. Rob Botton? Really? Or is it is it Botton or Botine? I can never remember. But yeah, the 
the gore effects were good, you know? Definitely. Yep, Lone Star helped cooperate. Botine, thank you, Luke. Okay. I like it. It's not great. It's definitely not one of Joe Tante's best films. No. It definitely was a Corman, like, we gotta get a movie like Jaws out there. Come yeah. on. Um, but it's not terrible. When did Jaws come out? Jaws? 73? 74? I don't know. Was it? I don't know. God damn it. <laughs> 75. Jaws was 75. Holy shit. Jaws 2 came out the same year as Piranha. That's probably what they were hoping to bank off of. Yeah, 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 probably. They got a sequel to Jaws getting out. Let's go. Well, thanks, everyone, for watching Yeah, this. thanks for coming and hanging out for Piranha. Yeah. Um, Sorry if you didn't enjoy it. Yeah, I hope you liked it. If not, like I said, watch the remake. I think you'll get much more enjoyment out of that if this one was too slow for you. Um, or just watch it in general just because it's fun. It's stupid and fun. Lots of CG, I'd be of course, though. It. Yeah, I w it would be fun to watch both of those movies. They're both, you know, if you if you know what you're getting into... You're, you know, this is just going to be dumb fun yep. with gore. Yep. Totally. I would love to see the second one in 3D. Yes. I have not seen it in 3D. But, uh, but yeah. It was a good time. Yeah, I liked it. I like it. You know, it's a little, it's a little slow, but. Yeah, I know. Almost turned into a story time. That's so right, Laz. Dude, the, fir the first half hour of the stream was like story time. <coughs> our stream is what we make it. Yeah, our stream is what we do. <laughs> <laughs> Not what I said. As long as we put a movie on, it's fine. That's the whole point. Are you ready to hop out? I mean, unless you want to talk about your exes more. I'm just kidding. <laughs> <laughs> no, I think I'm good on that. I'm kidding. I think I'm good on that. I'm kidding. Luke, they're showing Jaws 3D. Oh, that's cool. You gotta go, man. You got to. That'd be great. Alright, guys. Well, we're gonna hop off and make some dinner or something, I guess. Yeah. Um, thanks yeah. for coming back and hanging out with us. I know, you know, I was kind of worried that maybe one week off, everybody would be like, eh. Oh, yeah. <laughs> everybody just forgot all about it. I us. just worry about that stuff all the time. Um, but I, we're gonna be back Tuesday. We will... I think I'm gonna play the first... Alone in the dark. Because I figured out how to get that windowed and, you know, so yeah, it doesn't we'll take be, up the whole damn we'll screen. We'll finally figure it out. It was a very simple thing, and I wish I would have just found that on Google, but it took me that long. It took me this long, so. Well, you fixed it. But we'll play that, definitely. Okay. Famous last words. Exactly. Uh, have a good rest of your weekend, guys. Enjoy yourself. Um, relax. Don't worry about shit. Yeah. That's what we do a lot, you so do, doing... we're going to tell you don't do that. You're doing fine. You're doing good. Life's okay. Life's all right. Watch uh, watch the other Piranha movies, and you'll just forget about any bad thing. Yeah. <laughs> but, yes, we love you guys. Thank you for hanging out with us. Uh, we'll see you on Tuesday. Yep. See right. you guys. Bye, everybody. Bye.